Hey guys, it's Overlord here, back again with another video, and um, this one's kind of awesome, because the mail just came, and I just got a box. Yeah, it's just an empty box, there's, there's nothing fantastic in it at all. Oh, I'm kidding. But uh, this is from Maddie Collector. So it's kind of rare, I suppose. Luckily, I have scissors to open this with. So, huzzah! Hopefully, come on. Sound again? Let's see, what's this? That's a shipping receipt. Ooh. You all know what that means. No tissue paper? Eh, I'm kind of surprised. I got some from Entertainment Earth, uh, almost a couple of weeks ago, and it had like. Ten pounds of tissue paper, but am I kidding? But this is another Oh, that is too cool. Then the SDCC exclusive Doomsday from the DC Signature collection. <laughs> Pretty much the DC Universe Classics or the uh, Club Infinite Earths. Now this is what Tier 1 would have been. Which I think they should have just said screw the tier thing and just made this the exclusive. And the other Doomsday could have been the subscription figure. Then maybe the line wouldn't have died as bad as it did. But this is too cool. He's got so much... Freaking crap going on. I mean, this box is insane. He's got... He's punching a hole there. Right where my thumb is. Look at that. That's insane. And then he's got some cracks down here. Sort of see them. And then... There's a little bit more here. And then the back. He's just trashing the box. That's sick. Like I said, this is not a bad figure. It's appropriate for an exclusive. Ah, oh, this is... This is a freaking... Like, a cardboard sticker on top here. That's pretty cool. And soups should be in the background somewhere, right? Where is he? Where is the little son of a gun? Yeah, right there in the corner. You probably can't see him. But he's right behind the the logo right in the corner there but that's that's cool and then the uh, mailer box it's just a uh, matte black with the logo and a little bit shinier with a little bit shinier of a finish four minutes okay and it says Doomsday on the top. And then there's the bio. I'll review this guy, of course, so I'll give you guys a closer look at all this stuff. With uh, some better lighting, this is just one window. One window. Uh, we'd usually be back there having a look at stuff, so. Yeah, that is too cool. I'd like to open him on camera, but I don't know how long that's going to take. I don't know if this can just pop open. No, I'd have to cut through some tape. Uh, we're at four minutes still. Let's see if we can cut that tape. 
Ooh, that's not the strongest tape, is it? And open sesame. probably see Superman a little better. He's right up there, the red. Yeah, this, is, this box is insanely awesome. I love it. Is he being held in by wires or something? And he's got those crazy twist ties of certain doom. I don't know if we'll be able to just hack them off or what. Look at that, we have at six minutes. Not sure if I can just pull these off or not. They're pretty. There's one. There's two. Alright, there's one. I hate these things. They're like... Ghetto rope material or something. But, it's like that. I might just keep these as spares for my Batman and Robin 2-pack. Looks like he only has two. It's kind of shocking. But granted, this isn't the Spike Doomsday that everyone wanted. I still think it's a great figure. It's probably one of my favorites uh, that has come out this year. Because it's not, you know, run-of-the-mill character. Let's see, is that all of them? Let's see if we can this guy out. This is going to be such a chore. <laughs> this is amazing. Oh, 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 man. The head isn't too loose. Neither are the hips. I'm kind of surprised that I get one with, like, great... <laughs> and both his rockers work. This guy's in better shape than my Validus. Do his boots move? I thought his boots moved. How do you have cut down there? It does on that side. Well, there we go. I paid 50 uh, bucks for this, shipped, it was 35 on the website, with a total of like 11 or so shipping. Just trying to get the, oh man, <laughs> this is definitely a figure to get guys. You might not like this version, but heck, if you're a DC Universe collector, I sure that you will like this. And there he is. The one who killed the Man of Steel himself. In his first appearance, uh, yeah. 
That is bad to the ass. <laughs> uh, ten minutes, too. So we uh, did pretty good for ourselves. Pretty good indeed. So I hope you guys uh, enjoyed this unboxing. I'm going to enjoy playing with this. Arm feels a little loose there. I don't know. It is a... kind of like that over there, too. Whatever. Um, so that is Doomsday. Expect a review of him uh, sometime next week if I upload this Saturday, because that's when I'm filming it. Uh, if I'm filming it Sunday, expect a review late this week after, of course, the Marvel Legends Onslaught series. So, hope you guys enjoyed this. I have. Stay tuned for more. And, of course, Gargoyles Week is also on the way. And until next time, I'll catch you guys later. Doomsday has arrived.